Hi guys, welcome back to Dust Not Included. My name's Roy and I'm with Steph from Hi. Steph Sells Stuff by the Seashore. <laughs> We're gonna check out this Goodwill, guys. Let's go! Hello everyone. If you don't know Steph, you should totally check out her channel, Steph Sells Stuff by the Seashore. We had a great time spending time together. Over here on the first shelf, I spotted this red ashtray. I thought it was just a beautiful piece of glass. I did not, however, pick it up, but I believe Steph may have. I didn't see too much else on the shelf. I did spot this one lonely lusterware teacup, though. So over to the dishware aisle. I love this piece of glass bake. Glass bakes become very popular with the ever rising popularity of Pyrex. People are looking towards these other great pieces that have these amazing patterns as well. Someone took a bite of that watermelon. Then I spotted this beautiful piece of glass. It is a canoe shaped dish and it has this great optic design. It's beautiful. I almost forgot my cart. I was looking at this, what could be a vase. I, it might have been a decanter. It may have had a stopper at one point. It was kind of cloudy, so I did leave it behind. I was so excited because I thought I found a December boy angel. I was so excited. Then I realized he had no hands. <sighs> I was so sad. I wanted him, but I did leave him behind. Then I spotted this great Westfield mug. Unfortunately, it looks like it's been through the dishwasher a few times, but I loved this vintage mug by Westfield and its baseball theme. I wish it was just in a little bit better shape. This was a really pretty vase. I liked the color, but I did leave it behind, it was kind of simple. I th thought I scored again, this beautiful art glass turtle. But as I put it in the car, I noticed one of his fins was chipped off. This Goodwill's a little rough. So, what items do you like to collect? Did I miss something that you would have liked me to pick up? Leave a comment below, so next time I'm out, I can keep an eye out. Down with I think they considered their woodware aisle, I didn't really see anything that piqued my interest.
checking out this little bag here. There were two cute cats in there, but for the price of the bag, it wasn't worth just those two little guys. These items can be really great picks for um, eBay. People are always looking for the holders for the items they have. So if you see these, you should pick them up. I loved this brass enameled open worked pedestal dish. So I picked it up. Hey guys, at the end of the video, don't forget to subscribe and like the channel. Over here, I spotted a batter pitcher. I feel like I did. I was for the syrup not too long ago at a different Goodwill. Hmm, I wish I picked it up. I would have had a set. But I did leave this one behind since I didn't have the others. This music box was pretty. Rolling through the holiday section, mostly newer items, but I noticed something on the other aisle that I missed. It was a Lefton Victorian ladies shoe. It was so pretty, but like other items in the store, it was chipped up. All of those poor petals. So I did end up leaving the Lefton shoe behind. Hey guys. Every Thursday at 6.30, I have a live sale and I rotate channels with Janine's. This week, we'll be on her channel. Come check us out. Thanks for taking the time to shop along with me. As always, I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you soon.